we're gonna talk about one of my favorite platforms today. It's no secret, I love Snapchat. I love it. I'm in love with it. If I could marry it, I would marry Snapchat. I really would. So today, we're gonna talk about one of the more difficult subjects on Snapchat, which is how do you grow your audience? How do you grow your friend network? Um, it's not like any other network where you're seeing uh, different people that your friends are following and stuff like that. It's more of a private situation. So we wanna make sure that we're doing all the right things to grow our following and grow our community on Snapchat as quickly as possible. So these are my top five tips to grow your audience on Snapchat. Tip number one is your snap code. You wanna put that everywhere. So for me, I have it as my Twitter avatar and you can use it as your Facebook profile picture um, and you can pretty much post it everywhere as your profile picture on all of your different social platforms. And you can post it just as a photo on Instagram just to make sure that people know that you're on Snapchat and it's an easy way for them to screenshot that code or just to scan it and to follow you quickly. Another thing that you can do that I just recently discovered is snap tag stickers. So I have one on my phone and you can can download yours and purchase um, a pack of 10 of them at the website snaptagstickers.com. There's a link below this video where you can go and grab yours and you can get creative with where you put these. Um, just like don't use them as graffiti. That's my only tip. I did not tell you to use them as graffiti. Just put them on your own belongings. Tip number two is something that I say whenever you're starting on any social platform, the first thing that you wanna do is attract your warm leads. So these are your friends, your family, your current clients, and make sure that they know that you're on Snapchat. So you can send out um, an email to a few of your clients or your friends and your family with your code in it, letting them know that you're on there and to follow you. Um, you can also uh, add people with uh, the different features within Snapchat. There's several different ways to add your friends in Snapchat from your contact list to add Adding people nearby and one of my favorite new apps it's brand new uh, and I'm gonna give you guys exclusive access to it it's called ghost codes it's so brilliant because one of the biggest challenges on snapchat is to find people that you want to follow with similar interests to you so there's great search functionality in this app um, and you can also find people in specific categories and find people that share similar interests to you and have similar content to you so you can build deeper relationships with them uh, and actually see content that you're interested in so the code that you guys can use to get early access to this app is Pinky. Um, so I'll leave a, li a link below to Ghost Codes um, below this video and make sure to download that app. Tip number three is to repurpose your content. So you probably noticed that a lot of people have started doing this. You download your Snap story or an individual Snap and you can post it as an Instagram video or an Instagram photo. Um, you can post it on all the different social platforms natively to them. So as a native Facebook video, uh, Twitter video, whatever you want. Just make sure that you're sharing your content with your other audiences on your other social platforms as long as the content is relevant to them. It's a great way to, again, create more content but also to promote your snapchat account and another way to repurpose your content is to ask people to screenshot your content so if you have something specific that you want uh, people to remember maybe it's a quote maybe it's a tip uh, ask them to screenshot it and share it on different social platforms because again it's going to promote your content on snapchat and it's going to get more people to follow you so when they share that content on other platforms make sure that they tag you in it and share your snapchat username Tip number four is pretty simple. They're called Snapchat stories for a reason. So trying to create really interesting and engaging storylines and content that flows really nicely together will keep people engaged. And another tip on this note is to create themes around your content. So maybe on a specific day of the week, say it's a Monday, um, you do Motivation Monday. I know that's a very common one, but you could do a motivational quote or take a snap of a really motivational video or song that you're listening to and then try and find a theme for every day of the week because again, that's gonna keep people interested in coming back for, for more content from you. Fifth tip is Snapchat takeovers. So we've seen this on other social channels, um, but it works really well on Snapchat too. So have an influencer in your space or even a friend who maybe has a really engaged following on their account, have them take over your account and do a snap swap and swap accounts to grow your awareness and have a whole new set of eyes and a whole new audience uh, check out your content. But if you're gonna do this, make sure that you make the most of it and actually have some sort of storyline or content prepared so it's interesting for that person's audience. 
That's all my tips or my favorite tips to grow your audience on Snapchat. Now I'm going to send it over to a few of my favorite Snapchat stars to tell you how they grew their audience and what their number one tip is to make sure that you blow up your Snapchat community. So take it away. What's up, Sonny? My advice to gaining a following on Snapchat is doing lots of collaborations with other Snapchatters and promoting your Snapchat and other social media platforms. You. One of the best ways to grow your following on Snapchat is give call to actions like a screenshot and ask them to share it on a different platform, connecting and bridging. Major key to growing your following on Snapchat is by promoting your Snapchat code on other social networks like Facebook and Twitter. One way to grow your Snapchat following is to become a guest writer on blogs. Put your Snapchat username on the author box, and when they share your article, they'll also share your username. Create stories that surprise and delight people, that take them to unexpected places. Mysteries? Yeah. Everybody loves a good plot twist. It's the president. Mr. Mr. President, hold on one second. Completely integrate yourself with the Snapchat community and make sure you have a presence everywhere. Meaning, literally go on Google, search who to add on Snapchat, and comment your username on all the posts and videos about Snapchat. And I'm not saying like something boring like here's my username, but tell people compelling reasons about why they should add you and what you do in your stories. My number one tip for growing an audience, use the tools within Snapchat to create unique content worth talking about. Make sure you let your followers know that only on Snapchat will they be able to see all your content and you won't be giving it all away on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Amazing tips. Those people are all awesome, so make sure that you follow them on Snapchat. They're like best case examples of how to use the platform. Uh, and thank you guys so much for watching. If you have a Snapchat account, make sure that you leave your username below this video so that we can all follow each other um, and get some extra tips from all of you. And if you have a great tip for growing your audience that I didn't share today or that the Snapchat stars didn't share, um, make sure you leave it below this video as well. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, hit the like button below, share it with your friends, and be sure to subscribe and for an exclusive marketing tip that I only share via email, make sure you sign up at studylinergyz.com. And remember, this is now a Patreon-funded channel, so if you want to be a patron of my channel and get some awesome rewards, check out the Patreon link below this video. And if you want those Snap Tag stickers or to get that Ghost Codes app, both links are below this as well. Thanks for watching, happy snapping, and I'll see you guys later.